in film industry is that superheroes and romantic movies, the horror genre tend to dominate the blockbuster scene as they only revolve around two things, paranormal entities and the unknown horror. Aside from merely just an entertainment, viewers and avid fans of horror films tend to view this kind of genre as something that are closely related to their everyday lives. Moving to a new house in a new neighborhood or living in a secluded and remote places, viewers' imagination is more likely to go wild, hence increasing their sensation of discovering or being surprised by something they can even fathom. Then, with all the jump scares and suspense that are built throughout the whole film, this sensation-seeking mechanism is the main factor why people love horror films. From time to time, people love that doses of adrenaline rush they get from watching all those horror movies. But in the old days, when science and medical discoveries are far from what we already have, society would associate certain psychological conditions as something paranormal and mystical. Because it is so easy to associate something we do not know as something paranormal rather than trying to find the cause of understanding them through logic and scientific view. And this is where it gets worse. Even in this modern day, there are cluster of people, be it religious or non-religious, would associate hysteria and bipolar behavior as the act of demonic possession. Hysteria is one of the conversion disorder which stem from neurological and psychological distress. Extreme traumas, emotional distress, and internal pain are some of the causes of hysterical behavior. One of the extreme forms of hysterical behavior is a sudden body movement that bends extremely as if the person doesn't control his own body. This erratic and painful behavior is called opistotonus. Opistotonus is a specific abnormal posture associated with conditions and injuries that impair brain and muscle function. The characteristic symptoms of opistotonus are a severely arched and curved spine, head and heels that tilt backward. During primitive days, society would associate this condition as a demonic possession. Some traditional practitioner would even go as far as to perform an exorcism, believing that their patient's body was under the control of evil spirits. But the truth was, it was neurological disorders combined with muscle spasm, which impaired the patient's motor function. There are many causes of opitostenes such as meningitis, bacterial and toxic poisoning of the brain and nervous system, but there is not even one symptom associated to supernatural phenomenon. This clip shows some odd behavior resembling opistotonous disorder at the Historia Ward of the Public Mental Hospital in Ann Arbor, Michigan in 1935. Take a look. Overall, mental disorder and psychological problems are something that we should never take lightly. Rather than ostracizing people with nonsensical label, it is far more important to use a rational approach in dealing with this kind of situation. If you have any experience dealing with people who possess this type of medical condition, feel free to share it in the comment below. Thanks for watching and don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss our future updates. Until then, we will see you in the next videos.